We're almost there, Earth. Just a little longer, and then we'll finally be back on be on this gun, darling, like you promised. And then we're turning around and heading straight back home. We're gonna save you. We're so close now. Alright, here we go. Done some orders. We've got enough ace pilots. Next map determines which split we are going down. Are we going down path toward the true ending? Or are we going down the path towards the play through the game again ending? How is it, Doctor? There's nothing left for me to say. I see. Commander. Captain Bright? I plan to eat, leave Earthfleet Tenku in your hands when the time came. However, I seem to put my greed before I stand up. What do you mean? I want to see Earth again. It's what's driven me all this time. Back there we go. With Desler out of the picture, Gamelin have lost their world fight. All too, tr too true. All, we all we've left to do is retrieve the Cosmo Reverse system and this Kandar and head home. The bit rest certainly would be the worst thing for your body. Hmm. Is there something else bothering you? I have a dialogue choice. I now have the option for the true ending. I'm gonna take it. Our fight isn't quite over yet. What? Why? I don't expect Embryo nor Leonard Teslarosa to take a return to Earth quietly. I understand. Every single one of our crew will be at the ready and prepared for battle. I imagine we'd all live a bit of a breather after such a long and harrowing journey. Well. Not one of us can dare forget the mission we've been entrusted with. Wait, Commander, where are you going? We're almost at Iskandar. It's my duty to meet them at the bridge. Oh, really something. My apologies, Doctor, but I've... I need to hear a word more. We're behind you all the way, Commander. We and Earthfleet Tank. And remember, Earth is waiting for us. In my last task, we just one of all. That's what happens when ELS join a Gamelous Fortress City. It's beautiful. The wide flowers. Wait, Mrs. Grace, aren't those the ones you gave to Setsuna? I'd wager you they are. By coming to an understanding with Setsuna, the ELS came to understand humanity. Those flowers held something of his goodwill, a report with people, a vision of peace, of the future. I have to agree. There's something moving about a gamble and despot becoming one with those flowers. Attention! Commander Okita has something he'd like to say. My dear Earthfleet Tengu, this is Commander Okita of the Yamato speaking. You finally arrived at Iskandar. Take a good look. Look, Iskandar lies before you. And as I, as Commander Earthfleet Tengu, have something I would like to say. Thank you. That is all. I mean, we did it! All ships are to follow Iskandar's guidance. Earth's fleet tank will be going to the planet's surface. So, this is Iskandar! We're here. We're finally here. It's amazing! Like something out of a picture book. I don't know. Something feels off. The new types are a little nervous. So, Eurisha, what exactly are we doing here? We're to meet with my elder sister, Starsha, and tell her of our journey. First, we gotta see you off, don't we? 
I'll be acting as delegation leader and Commander Okun instead. This will lead the way, Yurisha. You and Sonata will accompany me. Who else? Azumu and Nimi did say they'd come. And so did you, Yuki. Ah. There you have it. Mori's on board. Of course, you can take everyone, but I have to choose. You. Er. And you. Who? Do you mean me? I do. That right. Beam Leader Desler is no longer with us. Indeed. The work of a life form known to the, to the Terran as an ELS. They saved us all. No reason to doubt them. It be the case for you. I still hover my own. Yes, my queen. Ah, oh, Abelt. About to grant my wish by bringing the beast, beast to the beast to the planet with an iron fist. I made a weapon of wave motion energy. Honestly. Your Highness, I may add that our salvation lay in a cannon that fired wave motion energy. I shall take it from here. By your leave, Your Highness. Oh, nice of his to speak in our behalf. Hmm. Try to save these earthlings, they follow the same world that adults did, that we did. My sister. Welcome home, Yurisha, and you, Sasha. Oh, I'm not. This is Yuki Mori, a native of Earth. Wait! I guess you two bear a resemblance. Sasha, she lost her life on Mars, bringing us the wave motion core. You are? Lieutenant Suzumu Kodai of the Yamato. I saw to her the Sasha's burial on Mars. The Earth is in her debt. He. But you all took wave motion energy and made it into a weapon. If you don't understand, we... Bend down, Suzumu. You make no excuses. What you've heard is the truth. So be it. You, Yurisha, you must tell me what you've seen. Before I do, sister, I ask you to look upon them. Hmm? Bonded with the being of living metal. Here I'd run out of things to be surprised by. I'm only a medium. With the ELS touched was the will of Earth's fleet tank with themselves. He will bear immense strength, sister. I've seen the supernatural Mazin and man-made gods that transcended time and space, controlled by the power of these humans. You, mechanical doll of the garden. Excuse me? No, but the nine is not some sort of doll. Quiet, Kisaragi. Who? Yes, Your Highness? They treasure you, they not? Yes. I would like the honor of speaking with you. Would you be so kind? Yes, Your Highness. Are you sure, Nine? The fighting with Ga between Gandam, Cardam, and Iskandar is over. Well, just let me know if there's something wrong, but try to be polite about it, okay? And don't feel like you have to come up with answers for things you don't know, and... Don't you don't have to do anything you don't you don't have to do anything you don't want to. You're being overprotective, sis. You just invited yourself along. I'm just worried about you, Nine. Don't worry, worry about the Cosmo Reverse system. I know, but still. Don't say Nine will be under my protection. Take care of her, Yurisha. Well then, Nine? Yurisha? Me? I'll speak with the Earthlings afterward. Okay, sister. Could Nine be doing? Yeah, Starsha's giving her a hard time about Gardim. You can't tell by looking how stubborn she is, but they start fighting. Fool it, will you? But what if. You're really worried about her, aren't you? Not like I don't understand, but Yurisha's with her and all. How can you say that? You can't tell what these Iskandar are thinking. I got the Starsha. I got the chills just looking at it. Tose, I want to hear another foul word about Iskandar from you. But what if. Need to chill out. Both of you. Katsuna, how did Starsha feel to you? You're an innovator. Can you get a read on what she was thinking? I wish I could. Thing is, but what is it? I, I felt despair. Something. The planet. Evil but lifeless. There might be a connection there. What did we do? We didn't come all the way here to walk away without the Cosmo Reverse. Didn't seem too pleased about the wave motion gun. Not like if we had any choice but to use it. Maybe he's right. Man didn't want to use it to use it as a weapon. He had to make it out. Maybe Miskindar will see that. 
should be ready in case worse comes to worse. Don't be stupid, Joe. Quite is right. We couldn't have, wouldn't have done it if it wasn't the right thing to do. We've come this par far, we need to own it. You're right. Ah, uh, good old Jovi is such a sucker for an instant smile. I waited the same way with you and Setsuna, Captain. Got you there! I feel like I missed something. Hey, what about Nine? I told you to cool it. The way you act is more like you're her mom than her partner. What if Starship takes an interest in Nine and tries to take her dad out? He would never. Oh, Eurisha. Where's Starship? Yuki, might we speak outside? Er... Feel that breeze. Nothing better than the deep blue sea. I'm assuming Yamato has landed, probably being in the water for the first time in its life. It'll be night soon. Hey, Risha, there's flowers over there. What are they? I call them blue crystal. Maybe we'll see them on Earth again someday. Who else they mean hidden life? An emotion. Life? What do you mean? Planet plays host to life. Remember its own matter of life's progress. It exists as a wave beyond space time. Memory is released by the planet's element. That in which holds the planet's thoughts. Its element. I see. And Cognal Reverse can't be completed unless the planet's element comes all the way to Iskandar. Which means there was no other choice but for you to come here. So you came. You and the Yamato. Using the element could keep, return the warp dimensions to their original state. It could keep the Earth from fusing. That which holds the thoughts of the planet. I think I know what it is. Do? I believe my sister is visiting Commander Okido. Element, you say? I do. And what will we use as an element? This very ship. Yamato? What you mean to say is... The ship will be transformed. Yamato itself will be the Cosmo Reverse system. I understand. I only pray I've made the right decision. You were offered a tool and rescue, and to rescue and turn it into a tool of destruction. We are well aware of the gravity of what we've done. What you called Wave Motion Gun, it was me who made it first. Speak of your war with Gardam. Ah! Right? Iskandar used its power to stain the large Magellanic cloud with blood. We're a great empire, vying for supremacy with other civilizations. None know the terror of that weapon better than we do, thus we've kept the technology a secret. Except after speaking with Eurasia and with Nine, I do believe I can have faith in you. Spoke objectively of your situation, and then she spoke passionately, stolen your virtue. You just promise me. Iskandar and Gardam have committed grave sins. You must not repeat them. Have my word. That's a sumu kodai. Yes, your highness? Will you join me? This, this is the cemetery, isn't it? Belief with... Beneath which the people of Iskandar sleep, all of them, save Yurisha and myself. Ah, no other planet should bear this sorrow. I ask why you brought me here. I brought you because M Mamoru Koda rests here as well. Did you say Mamoru? Gatlin Prison Transport lost control and crashed in Iskandar. His brother was on it. Most likely he's being transported as a biological specimen. Wait, wrong voice. Most likely he's being transported as a biological specimen, he was the only survivor. He managed to take him in without attracting notice from the Gamblins. His body, however, was... In the end, I wasn't able to save him. Your... You... You see this capsule? It contains a message from him. I did you were to take it. Thank you, Your Highness. This is Mamoru Kodai, member of Earth Federation forces and commander of the destroyer Yukikaze. Ah. Ah. Uh. I have been captured by Gamblin forces. While being transported as a lab specimen, the ship crashed. I was saved by an Iskandarian female. She informed me of a ship, he ship headed from Earth. Ship from Earth headed this way. If you're hearing this, it must mean you that you've made it. 
if I had it my way, I'd be going back to Earth with you. But something tells me I won't hold out that long. There are two things I want to leave with you. First is that we and other species can understand each other. Being here taught me that, and you need to remember it. Oh. Hmm. The other thing is, and this is to you, Susumu. Oh. Make sure you're doing enough living for the, for the both of us. The Earth is going to be green again. You'd better be there to see it. I will. Here's the clear seas ahead, and a safe trip home. Seems to be all. Okay. It was here. It was in the cold depths of space. His eyes closed here on solid ground. Ladies and gentlemen, let's go home. Earthfleet Tenku will make it our mission to fulfill your wish, Amaru. Yes, sir. This Mamoru Kodai, did you love him? I used to, but now... I'll take my leave. Do whatever you need to, Nii. Mamoru, going back to Earth, taking your memory with us. You sure? I'll proceed to Gamelis to offer aid to those that I can. Thank you, Your Highness. And Melda? I trust that you'll give the Yamato a proper send-off. Yes, Your Highness. We'll accompany them as far as the Milky Way. Here's to a new beginning, Melda. Indeed. I hope that I can serve as a bridge between our two planets. Earthly Tenku have received the Cosmo Reverse, and now we set out for Earth. Let's go home. <laughs> Earthly Tenku, I wish you a safe voyage. Thank you kindly. The Earth owes you and yours a great debt. We'll not waste what you've given us. I don't believe I that I'll find myself here again, but the young and strong will. On that day, I believe there will be peace between you. I hope to see that day for myself. Farewell. Yamato leaves. Farewell, my other self. Farewell, courageous earthlings. And to you, Mamoru. Karsha Iskandar. Another mechanical doll. I beg to differ. Why are you here? This planet is worthless now. Wait! You've come to say goodbye to the cloud. So goodbye, Miss Kandar. Those, those in the Milky Way can watch as it rots. So it continues. A strong Earthquake Tenku, Mamoru will see you through. We are not quite done with the Gardem. With the Cosmo Reverse System in hand, the crew puts Iskandar behind them, using their remaining Worth Gate on planet Balan to hasten their return to Earth. One final battle awaits them on the other side. Alright, we get one ship to take with us to sign with the Yamato. Or to pick along with the Yamato. Kalium some, the Nahal Argama some. All mayas. All earthly tanky vessels now safely through the subspace gate. If we can make it through this, we should arrive right at the edge of the Milky Way. That's. We haven't had an animated background before. The good thing that Balan's gate system was active. You're telling me this makes for one heck of a shortcut back to Earth. We went through quite a lot in getting to just getting to Balan, but in the end, we made it. I suppose it's as far as we need to guide you. Relay this message to Yamato. We'll be praying for the ship's safe packet passage. Farewell, Yamato. I'll make it on my own, somehow. Your character design reminds me of the character design for the for Sam Gamgee in the Rankin Bass slash TMS version of Return of the King. It's the nose. 
He's going off with the space. Which, what's got you doing off space, newbie? Come, let's head back to the common room. Roger. I like your attitude. <laughs> Thank you. He was also an engineer. He's very skilled. Oh! He's one of the Amado crew. I guess. The captain picked him up from the detention center and left the Porta. His influence is quite impressive. Good luck, Yamato. The Earth is counting on you. Gamma Subspace Submarine is withdrawing. Wish we'd taken that Castle with them, too. Oh, well, we can't force him to return to Gamelus if he doesn't want to. Yeah, I guess not. Worry about Operations Officer Mori? The campus somebody we picked up must have been a high-ranking Gamelon officer. Mori did say there were acquaintances, but I hope she's all right on her own. She's the one who asked to do this interrogation. She's not worried at all. Up until a while ago, no one would have ever imagined we'd been rescued by Gamelons, let alone have them guide us to safety. She was stuck drifting out there because she had engine trouble. We couldn't just abandon her. And sadly, she was the only survivor. There's only so much we could do. Anyway, we... <clears throat> Right now, we're better off worrying more about this ghost that's supposedly on board the ship. Wasn't this an issue back when we were on the way to Iskandar 2? Now time to turn to the Phantom of Eurasia, lying dormant in the automatic navigation room. But this ghost is apparently wearing a Federation uniform. And it always seems to appear in the heart of the Cosmo Reverse System, which we put in place of the Wave Motion Gun Controller. Really? That's where it shows up? That reminds me, we installed the controller in another ship without any modifications, right? Yes. It was an urgent request of Reba Takis, being stored on the Nonigas Undiscovered Research. You know, I hope the Arisa Battle isn't over yet, but still, I hope nothing happens that makes us have to use the big motion gun again. Meanwhile, on the Nondisco, <clears throat> oh, Nihil Argama! Judo, I equipped the double Zeta with those fully armored parts like you asked. Thanks, Astonaj. Now I should be able to fight even more effectively than before. Except for upgrades. Oh! We're gonna, like, so skeezy. We're gonna, like, this is setting up all four of the, of the upgrades we're just getting leading into this. Although that means you can't transform, though. You're under fire or run out of ammo? You jettison the armor right there on the battlefield. When we get back to Earth, we'll have the final battle waiting for us, won't we? we simply can't. We cannot allow Leonard, Embryo, and Leonard to do whatever they please with the Earth. In a situation like this was before, weren't we? Pack and I pretending to be Eurisha. Sure. Pay your ship, and you can use it to get back to Gamblers. I have no intention of ever returning to that time. What? There's no home for me to go back to anymore. These Aurelians have the power to read people's minds. Those who looked other planets hated and feared us for it, and they destroy us. Now he, Supreme Leader Dessler, has rescued me and the other survivors. It's with him that I belong. I said you feel that way, but... Dessler died in Scream Leader Dessler died in battle. That's not true. He needs me. He wouldn't die like that. He wouldn't leave me. <clears throat> what? We're being attacked? I know this feeling. It's him. What just happened? Sir, our radar isn't function Sir, our radar isn't functioning. Because we're inside the gate. Incoming! Gamelins! And that blue ship belongs to their supreme leader. I built Tesla, so he survived. How they manage to approach us so suddenly? They seem to be a bit more experienced fighting as I was supposed to be escaped than we do. Enemy fleet engaging! I don't believe this. I thought we were done fighting against the Gamelins. This fleet ignored Admiral Deet's summons. Clearly they are part of the existing command structure. I mean, these troops are entirely loyal to Tesla. Gamelin soldiers now infiltrating Deck 2! Damn it, they're too close. Ain't too close to drive them off with our guns. The know we have available to counter the attack. Kodai, you will take command of the close combat troops. Yes, sir. How very rude of you to show up when you're fighting. Don't even think about trying to get through here. Team 2, sweep around the engine room. Some of them are headed that way. Cleared out all the enemy command all enemy combatants. And this woman is the only one left. What? 
Well, if it isn't the Iskandarian lady, though I suppose I should really call you the imposter. Oh, well, Dessler, I never believed... I never believed that you would personally board the Yamato. Please stand back, so please, please, leader. I can handle this. Oh, no. I'm going to have this woman act as my guide. I will do no such thing. Come now. Why don't you take me to see your commander? I would so very much. Commander Okito would never meet with the likes of you. Hi, what a very spirited princess you are. Supreme Leader! Ah! What? Oh. So Stella, it was you. Why? You meant everything to her. How could you do something like that? I never intended to shoot her. I sensed her psycho waves and simply reacted without thinking. There was never any need for Earth to gamble and gamblers to fight in the first place. We could have cared for each other. We could have loved one another. No, we did have to fight. We needed to conquer the other planets in order to guide them to safety. I had to fight for that sake of the one person that I truly love. What? That's right. Gardam fell precisely because they didn't understand that. Gardam didn't understand love? Yuki! Kodai! They're on approaching. Quenching fire. No, not Suzumu! Ugh! Yuki! Hmm, that Terran girl got in the way. This time I won't miss. Hold your fire. Dessler. Put down your weapon. I'm pulling out. Sir, how about destroying the engine room? That won't be necessary. Let's go. Yes, sir. Yuki? Oh. No, Yuki! Enemy ship disengaging. All right, another range of our cannons. Watch out, mobile units. Prepare to engage. Objectives are... Beat the big command ship. Um, Sasuke can't die. No battleships can get wrecked. No can get wrecked. And we have to do it in five turns. Select. Mark the bus. Melt this. Next. Zero. Okay, max on, max on creating the guard diver next. Turn. Yeah, for cash bonuses, I need to upgrade the Vang Ray. Oh, why? Um. Also, need to re equip stuff on the Vang Ray. Uh. Get two. Get her. We got Sasuke, which means I need to bring Ertz Kuso. This one Melda, which you get some good story dialogue. Zeta, um, I believe Kenji has an upgrade. So, like, Angie gets an automatic deployment. Automatic deployment, okay. Yep, Angie, Angie has confirmed deployment. Curse that Dessler, how is he still alive? 
Well, they say what the dictator of our country is doomed to die like a dog. What do you say we bury this wretch clinging so desperately to his former glory? Lively as ever, I see, Angie. Embryo! What are you doing here? Why, well, I'm here to claim my bride. That's a shame, because there's no way I'm ever going to accept your proposal. Right, Tusk and I are already... Right, I'll deal with you later, Angie. Huh? They are here for her. That came from the Eternal. I'm sorry, everyone. Lacus was kidnapped by Embryo. Kira! Lacus! Embryo, so you're after Princess Lacus? I rather like the idea of a woman with the blood of the ancient... Having a woman with the blood of the ancient people as a, for a bride? Amusing, isn't it? Now shall we go, Princess Lacus? I know what you're really up to. You're coming after me so you can get to Angie. Then simply have the revenge on the ancient people who defied you. Ooh, ouch, that's so harsh. I'd expect... Nonetheless, from the deep of the battlefield, Lake is fly. Embryo! Don't worry, Angie. You still have your place as first among my wives. You'll have to follow me if you ever hope to get her back. Well, I doubt you ever can. Even can. Lake us! Damn it, where do you disappear off to? Can't even follow him in here without our radar. No, is there nothing we can do? We can start by attacking the gamblins right in front of us. All units? Captain! Now what? What is that? Boson particle reaction confirmed. There are far more of them than would normally be required for a boson jump. Something stabilizing a jump field inside subspace? Dimensional horizon distorting rapidly. Possible. Base itself is distorting? We haven't actually gotten our mission title card yet, and we're 30 minutes in. What? Nine, what's wrong? Look where we are. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks. Also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.